Hello guys and welcome back to a new video on Roblox Warlords. Today we're going to be comparing the tactician unit and the warlord unit. And yes, um, somewhere in this video there will be a, um, a giveaway from, um, from the last video names. Not yesterday's one, but the one before that, um, you know, because there's enough time so people can watch the other video and they can wrote their names. But, um, uh, so before I start, I just want to say, even if you don't win, guys, don't worry about it, because um, hopefully you will win on Sunday, because, um, uh, you know, I'll be making a lot of giveaways and, and stuff like that. And guys, I want to say, well, right now I'm recording the day before actually upload this so right now we're on 993 subscribers but i'm gonna guess that tomorrow we will be at 1k so i'm gonna say this already um, so thank you so much for getting 1k or 900 subscribers 993 subscribers right now in this current moment thank you so much guys anyways um let's get right in okay guys so now that we've gone into the game and originally i was going to be on the tactician to start off but um i saw the enemies had two mongol um heavies and the first thing you need to know about the tactician is it is not anti uh, anti um, cavalry guys cavalry can be similar to the archer a bit because of its low armor and stuff um, so yeah i picked all those so yeah um, so let's start with the first ability on the wall though which is um spear wall right now and um guys i want to real quick say shout out to united monk uh, monk because um you know he recognized me and i uh, started <laughs> Um, you know, saying, Oh my god, so no, but yeah, anyway, so this people, you know, self explanatory, um, uh, you know, it's just it's a normal spear wall, just like any other guys. You can use this to go behind like Spartans or like any other shield wall, and then you can do damage. And actually, something to note about is it's actually very good in this, um, it's very laggy right now, guys, but it's actually very good, um in like in the city for example if you stand here um and just be a wall to ais that can be very good guys making them very low especially because of its armor penetration but guys by the way the lag is not from um my recording apparently now it is from the actual game itself from the city game mode but yeah the next ability is um shock charge what this does is it stings the enemies the first enemies you hit for six seconds so after you hit an enemy it will sting them for six seconds and then um you can use this as an advantage even against like hammers if you play right or any other unit claymores crusaders any any unit and even cavemen anything um and this is of course very good and it makes you faster as well and more damage. And then the next ability is um, field rations. Um, what was that? But yeah, field rations. Um, uh, you know, it heals the enemies. Not the, not the enemies. Sorry, sorry, not the enemies. It heals your troops. Only your troops, not you, not the actual hero, which is you. Just your troops heals them a bit. I personally don't like it because it heals them ever so slightly. It doesn't heal them much. But yeah, so now let's go get gameplay. And um, first we see. Am I lagging or is it? No, no, no. I can't. Is it? I can't. Speak, is it? I can't speak right now. Is the game lagging or is it? Is it me? Guys, I'm so excited right now. I'm recording this the day before um, I upload this. So right now, we're on 993 subscribers, I think. So we need just slightly, um, we need like seven subscribers. Oh, they're saying I'm lagging. Hmm. Not sure. We're just going to wait until they come, guys. We're just going to wait until they come. Okay, guys, so now we're recording again, but um, unfortunately, um, the game is so laggy right now, guys. I'm even on low graphics right now. I'll set it to high graphics, but it is so laggy, guys. Um, so laggy, guys. I'm not sure. Um, yeah. I'm not really sure what to do. It's so laggy right now, guys. 
Okay, guys, so sadly the game is lagging and I just cannot play, so you cannot actually see the good gameplay um, because Waldo is such an underrated um, unit, guys. It's definitely like probably the best unit, in my opinion, um, for the fact like it has 40 armor penetration and, this, and it's a spear unit with shock charge, meaning like it's anti cavalry. As you see, the Mongol heavies right now, just, I'm destroying them right now. Wherever they are, oh, this cannon is so annoying. The, the game is so laggy. I'm, I'm not sure what to do, guys, because I don't have much time to record sometimes. And today is one of the days I don't have much time to record. Meaning, well, meaning, uh, I cannot redo this video. I, oh my god, this cannon! Oh no. Come on, I don't want to go in the cannon again. Leave. I am. Let me go, let me go, let me go. For you! Okay. Come on. I can't walk. I'm lagged. I cannot walk. Ah, oh, this game is terrible. It is terrible. Um. Come on. Okay, hey guys. Um. If you're new to the channel, please, guys, please make sure to hit the like and subscribe button because it's promoting my channel and subscribing will help me reach 1k if I have not reached it yet because I cannot pre predict the future, of course, so I don't know because for the third time I'm, I'm recording this the day before I actually upload it because of like schedule and stuff. Okay, so Shield is going to be dead. Um, there you go, shield is dead, so now we might as well um, get the Spartan because that's the only, only option and if we get it right now before um, the enemies get close, before the Mongol enemies get close, then that's going to be good. We're also going to use field rations to help out a bit. Mongol, oh no, I was about to say Mongol heavy is dead, but he's not. Okay, come on, come on, come on. It's so laggy. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have much time to like, re record this. Uh, by the time I edit it, and you know, uh, hmm, not sure what to do. I mean, you can, guys, you can look at my, um, my other videos. Um, about this unit because they are they are not like laggy. I said I think so, but they're not laggy. And yeah, guys, they're not laggy, so you can actually understand them and understand the gameplay a bit more. Come on, they're all so low, guys. They're all so low. No, I died. Now the cavalry are gonna be here. No. Oh, it's okay, guys. It is okay. I said I hope so. I hope we win this game. I hope we win. Okay, guys. Um, I forgot to do the um, the what's it called? The giveaway winners. And I was looking through the last video, and I saw only two people actually commented their username, meaning um, it's a fifty-fifty chance, guys. First, we're gonna shuffle, but and but before we start, I want to say the winner will only be unfortunately getting five robux because. This giveaway was only two people who joined, I mean, like, it's very easy to win, it's a 50-50 chance, not very easy, but it's a 50-50 chance, and, um, yeah, guys, normally, of course, I would do 10 Robux, but there's no point, because it's only 50-50, uh, sorry for the winners, but here we go, so first we're gonna shuffle, um, 1, 2, 3, and 4, that's 4, so I'm not cheating, guys, um, and, Let's start now, guys. Here we go. Good luck. And Tyra plays YT is the winner, guys. Um, congratulations to you. Make sure to join my group and to receive your five Robux. And okay, guys. So now, um, now we're with the tactician unit um, gameplay and um, you know the review, the comparison of the tactician part. This is probably one of my favorite units, like, it just came out, and it's already one of my favorite units, and I would rate it probably, I would rate it number one, um, best troop, before it used to be Waldo, 
it still is but um i would have rated it number one uh but it does not have armor guys it has barely any armor meaning um like you can die very quickly and like cavalry mongol heavies kibbing etc they can like demolish this unit guys because it has this unit has no armor and stuff but anyways so first i want to go through the abilities and so the first ability is um fire pit what this does is um depends on depending on where you're facing for example if i'm facing front right now and i use the fire pit there'll be there will be fire um over here for example cavalries are coming in what i can do i can go in the middle make a fire and when people step in here they can take damage but guys beware because even your own teammates and your own troops and even you you can also take damage from the fire pit not just your enemies guys so yeah that's kind of the bad part of it but I guess that's what's um, making this unit interesting and fun to play with. And then the next ability is um, transport supply. What this does is, as you can see, it's like making a ring with a like, cart in the middle. And um, every time um, somebody takes health from it, either you, your teammates, or heroes, um, this like the the um, oh I can't this like thing is taking health from it into the into the actual people, the units, meaning after after a while, after you use it a lot, this cart will be uh, despawned, of course, because it'll have zero health aid like left. So then the next ability is um, deploy decoys. This is, of course, right now, like, it, it, would sh it would be very good because the claymores right now, they have high damage and the berserker, so they can focus on that whilst um, we're taking out one you when um leader are at a time which is very good of course and i'm taking that right now and but i cannot leave because of oh guys i just died i hate these cannons especially the one in the middle i absolutely hate it every day i not every every game i legit die or lose from just this thing but anyway so yeah um i'll be right back after we respawn but okay guys, so now um now we're back. Um finally respawned. Fire no Oh no guys oh no oh no oh no oh no oh no no Uh I legit just respawned and I died because of the cannons again I hate these cannons guys they ruin my video they ruin everything come it's okay Okay guys so that's gonna be it for this video I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, please make sure to hit the like and subscribe button because we are so close to 1,000 subscribers, and I'm not sure if we have reached it already because, of course, um, I recorded this the day before I actually uploaded it, so right now we are, we need six subscribers till we reach 1,000, guys. I am so excited, but yeah. So um, anyways, overall, I would probably say this is a very hard um decision because um well because well tactician has better abilities by far the fire pit deploy decoys and the um the other one the heal thing um i really don't know guys but stronger i probably would say waldo to be honest because first of all it has 40% armor penetration. Second of all, as you saw in the video, Tactician died so, so, so easily, guys. Legit, that is super easy. Not to the cannon, yeah, because of course the cannon, every, every unit will, would or should die to the cannon. But not because of the cannon, but because of the, to any other, like, enemy, it, sh it would die very quickly. So you need to be careful, so... It's like a support unit, of course, and you need to, like, stay behind um, your teammates. Or actually, when the enemies are fighting your teammates, you can go behind the enemy and flank them and hit them because you've got high damage but low armor. So, yeah, try to hit the people, but try to make them hit you as less as um, possible. And use the fire pit, of course. That's what is, like, very good. Because as you saw in the video, like... If the enemies are AFK or um, they're standing still, you can you can use the fire pit and hit them and damage them without even like needing to necessarily actually fight with them. So yeah, thanks so much for watching and have a great day.